Purpose Pusher moment. I have a message for you all today. It's a message that's not just for you, but it's also a message for me. I wrote a post this morning titled, Gotta Go. And the post was just basically talking about the fact that so many of us can get caught up in the monotony and the mundane tasks that accompany life that we don't ever really make intentional time to sit down and review our lives. Take an inventory of ourselves and see where we're struggling, and where we're rolling and rocking, and where we need to really give some more attention to. And, and, and because we don't do that, we look up a year later, two years later, five years later, on and on and on, and we haven't made much progress. And then we wonder why. And we, you know, we just kind of in a funk. Life is just hard. But life doesn't have to be hard. And the progress that we'd like to see can be made manifest so much easier if we would just get a goal. Well, after I got that post out and the importance of having a goal and many goals in your life, I thought about all the conversations that I have with so many of my friends and, and, and associates who say, you know, that sounds good and, you know, makes me feel real warm and fuzzy when you talk like that, Iana. But the bottom line is this, I mean, it's hard out here. It's hard to stay focused on a goal. We got so many things competing for our attention. And when I start to think about the things that I'd like to do, it's just it's too much. It's too overwhelming, you know, because I got other responsibilities. Well. Here's what I want you to know. This is the message. Whatever it is you want to do, whatever it is you think you need so that you can do it, whatever it is you desire to have so that you can do it, whether it be being a better parent, whether it be building a business, whether it be having better relationships, whether it be building your spiritual life, whether it be being a public speaker, whether it be anything you can imagine, from the most simple to the most complex, it's already in you. If I don't know anything else, I know that for sure. I believe that we come into the world, each of us, with unique, unique gifts that God has given us to be able to impress upon the world in our own unique way. But as we get older, we start to get further and further away from that voice on the inside. We get further and further away from the urge to do what it is we came here to do. Yeah, the urge to do it. And so I'm just giving this little message today because I'm hoping that it will touch someone, if just one, and make you say, I need to get a goal. And I need to understand that it's already in me, that whatever I need, it's already there. God has it there, and all I need to do is start to focus on it one reasonable step at a time so that I can bring it into fruition, that I can see it made plain. We don't have to know what all the steps are gonna look like. We don't have to know what it's all going to pan out to be. Matter of fact, you can't know. Because if you think you're in control of the process, that's an illusion in and of itself. You're not in control. You're not. The Creator is in control. But He needs you to participate. She needs you to join her in this process. So, remember, it's already in you. Step up. Stop playing. Start pushing.